it's time for it's time for it's time for us to pull some cars hey it's time for us to pull some cars hey. i got a visitor right here now he thought i was fishing ain't all right fam fam i'm glad i got that off my chest i really hope that i don't damage anybody's heart or feelings with anything that i just said I just had to let that off because I'm just tired of this shit. I'm tired of being misunderstood and I'm tired of y'all treating us like we are just the most horrible beings on earth when I know that I intentionally go out of my way to be a good person. So that's bullshit to me. I don't want to hear that shit no more. Um, in my opinion, this world is just dark. Everybody be treating everybody like shit and it's sad especially sorry and fellas please don't kill me but the men y'all really be like passing y'all pain down like jesus i need all of us to sit sit back and let's heal and let's work through some of this pain that we carry all of our disappointments in life we can't keep taking it out on each other you know i just need a real friend in life that's all i want some real love did you just turn right back <laughs> that's all a bitch asking for some real love so anyway after that reading i am getting ready to pull some quartz and see what messages the universe has for us in regards to what we just talked about I hope you walk he don't walk back this way anyway but yeah i just want y'all to know that aquarius are empathetic we are not distant if we are distant it's for a reason and i the three and four goes into why we're distant okay we don't like fakeness we don't like being manipulated because life is we grown bro like why do you have to manipulate you can just ask how old are you that's sad that you feel like Life is a game and you have to play people to get what you want. Uh-oh. They go two cards. Beyonce not playing though. Hey, hey. And it's so cozy. What cards we got? Oh shit. <laughs> Ten of Pentacles. That's cute right there. And two of Pentacles. Okay. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. What's happening? Titles. Why are you not playing cozy? Cause that one is my skin. Cozy with who I am. I love myself. Goddamn cozy. Hey, co I love me, but did I tell you hate me? Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> hey, cause you want me. Hey, hey, um, hey, hey, ah, uh, ah. Uh. No, let me stop. All right, let's see what other cards come up. But yeah, so when, I'm just tired of being on the outskirts. Like, even if I could just meet somebody that's super like-minded, just like, you know, have these same thoughts that I'm having right now. Let's be friends, please. I'm tired of people that think I'm weird and don't like nothing that I like. It's like, well, get around me. Like, why do y'all be around me? Because y'all think I'm cute? Like... There's more to life than being cute. Trust me. It ain't all what it's cracked up to be. Just like having a big booty. It ain't nothing but trouble. It's a bunch of damn meat. Shit be heavy. <laughs> Gotta clean it a lot. And it attracts rats just like cheese. Oh, I've never gotten this card. This is beautiful. What is that? Mm. I think this is 19, the sun in reverse. This is what the card looks like. It's beautiful, but it was in reverse. So we're going to see what that's about. All right, let's keep going. All right, universe, let's do two more cards. You know, I like to do five. I brought my other um, Clear Vision Duo tarot set as well. So we might pull a card or two from there. I might do one for each stack because each stack represents something different. Hmm, let's see what we get. It's getting chilly though. I gotta hurry up. So I gotta go home. Buy me something if I can eat. I'm so tired of being broke. I'm so tired. I'm so tired. Every day I wake 
woke up our bitch. I'm so tired. I'm so tired. I'm so tired of being broke. I'm so tired. I'm so tired. Every day I wake up our bitch. Hey, there we go. The tower card. See, they're my friend. Hey. All right, let's see if we get any more hmm. towel moment. Really, is one coming or did I just have one? I wonder. Towel moments are good though. I remember having good feelings around towel moments when I pulled them in California. Let's see. Ooh, there we go. The Goddess of Pentacles. That's beautiful. I've never seen this card either. Yay! I'm finally getting new cards. I'm tired of <laughs> recycling. So we're definitely gonna go through those. I also have this deck, which is a double. All right, so I forgot what they stand for. I always have to do this. So the green side. All right, so we got exchanges versus encounters. And the exchanges are, you know, so one's willing to manifest. So this has something to do with what we're going to manifest, I hope, in the near future. And then the blue cards is wishing to connect. So just connect it with the universe, I guess, and just getting a message from the universe. So I'm going to pull a card from each. There you go. Hey, Kobe is my skin. Rest, not quit. Okay, okay. All right, rest though. Hey, 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 hey. Hey, hey, all right, one more time. Cozy. I love me. They hate me. <laughs> Cause they want me. Swaggy. Effortlessly. <laughs> Chicken leg change. Hey, baby. Hey. All right, one more card, baby. Oh, I get paid tomorrow, hopefully. My second ass check will be here too. Not puppet master. I don't want that one. Let's keep going. <laughs> Sorry, you know. Alright, what's this one? I don't want the black hole either. Give me a new card. Give me something I've never had before. Talk to me. Okay. There we go. The one of wonders. Ooh, is that cool cat? Hmm. Interesting. Alrighty then. Oh, huh? And it kind of was in the reverse, but I don't think these do reverse, so we're not going to worry about it. Let's go ahead and go through these meanings first. All right, so the Ten of Pentacles. Let's see what the hell happened. Hey. Hey, yay. All right, so we got Ten of Pentacles. So the Ten of Pentacles, <coughs> excuse me, represents the complete surroundings of lasting abundance. Yay! Here a couple walks hand in hand down a pinnacle line pathway towards a vision of material joy. A rainbow appears as to signify that this is a lasting gift of abundance. And hold up. Okay, and the Ten of Pentacles leading up to this beautiful destiny provide a clear and comfortable path to its luxuries. I guess the universe wanted me to read it again because it kept going over. This is a lasting gift of abundance. Okay, thank you. Because I asked for that the other day. Um, the Ten of Pentacles is a beautiful indication that everything is coming together. Finally, you are now blessed and surrounded by some level of material wealth. 
You currently have all you need and more, both financially and within your home unit. Your family shall also benefit from the gains you have acquired, and you shall be proud of the lasting success you have created for yourself and the ones you love. Well, damn. Start off strong then. That was nice. All right, let's get a two of pentacles. Two of Pentacles. So the goddess of the Two of Pentacles is performing a great balancing act. She stands in a generally uncomfortable place as she attempts to juggle two pentacles. And even though she has a look of concern, she flows and dances in the wind upon this rock as the internal balance of emotion and logic have given her not one, but two pentacles. Oh, to have, sorry. So the waterfall behind her crashes into a peaceful body of water as to show that, that turbulence can end in peace if all flow accordingly. Thank God. So there are times when life requires a bit of balance, okay? So you may have a conflicting interest at this time and you need to figure out how you can best manage the two. Uh-oh. Know that... Your potential is limitless when you eff when your efforts are infinite. It is important to continuously flow with the turbulence of life just as the water flows downward in a waterfall. Both shall eventually result into the onset of peace. Okay. So now we're going to do 19, which is the sun in reverse. Let's see. Okay, so in its reversal, the sun urges you to look deeply at the positive or bright side of life, okay? It asks you to be more optimistic and childlike by learning to let go of your worries, even if only temporarily. But the sun reverse also can indicate being too optimistic. Confidence is great, but do be sure you are not taking on more than you can actually handle. Okay. For sure, for sure. So now we're gonna go with the tower, which is 16, yes. All right, so the tower is representative of destruction, shocking change, liberation, and freedom. Where you were once trapped by the devil, you now see those same once comforts as the hindrances they truly are nice, because I had the devil card last time. Okay, so as the indiscriminate clouds of misfortune rain down, your eye open. So struck down and deem this form to be no longer acceptable by your spiritual consciousness. And with this realization, with both your generations before and behind you on your back, you will jump and fall face first into the light. Okay. So this may not be a welcome moment, but it is necessary. Mm. So when the tower card is revealed, it is time to let something go. This may be some type of breakup, breakdown, natural disaster, or generally the loss of something that used to cause you to feel secure. So releasing this form now will help you to embrace and identify with the light. Mm, have courage, let go, it's time for something better. Don't know what the hell that's talking about, but I'm pretty sure it'll make sense in the end. So lastly, we have Goddess of Pentacles. I'm trying to find it. My damn foot falling asleep on me. Ooh. And I got a tangle. Alright, so whoa, she got along. Alright, so the Goddess of Pentacles is a multitasking mother figure that has succeeded at doing it all. So she sits peacefully in the garden as she nurtures her pentacle. For as she nurtures, she is sub subsequently nurtured herself. Surrounded by the growth of lu luscious abundance, this goddess is connected to the essence of Mother Earth. Hey, Mother Earth. I am Mother Earth, though. So, you know. So notice how a few butterflies glide through the wind around her as she like them provides material hope insulate and prosperity to those around her so the goddess of pentacle is a master at taking care of the multiple needs of herself and others shout out aqua gang 
She is the ultimate mother archetype as she can do it all, which includes providing. So therefore, at this time, be confident in your efforts because you are the ultimate force. I don't know why my voice changes like that on certain words, but it has meaning, <laughs> clearly. I can't wait to hear that. So you have the divine abilities to multitask, maneuver, and care both personally and financially for yourself as well as those whom you love. You have achieved a certain level of harmony and flow with the opposing responsibilities you carry. And at this time, you can enjoy this healthy balance as it's luscious growth of prosperity and security. If that was not the best reading I've ever had, shout out to the universe. Okay. So I'm pissed off about my check, but this clearly tells me don't be, baby. This is the end of your financial burden. You about to get this money and then everything is gonna be smooth sailing from here. I feel like all of the scholarships that I'm applying for, I'm gonna get. All of the internships that I'm applying for, I'm going to get offers and I'm gonna be able to choose and decide which one I wanna do, which one I don't wanna do. I think my life is definitely moving in the right direction now. And I'm glad that those cards had those particular messages on it. Cause I was pissed. Like I'm very sad that I don't have any money to get nothing to eat, but I got groceries. I'm gonna just have to get some shit out of the freezer and throw some shit together, which I don't want to, but you know, it is what it is. I get paid tomorrow. So your girl definitely get art sales, sorry. Books tell me for life. Okay. So rest. <laughs> okay, so some shit like that would be weird. But anyway, we're not gonna go. We're gonna rest not quit. <laughs> I know I'm silly. I'm silly. I'm not weird. Like I I'll take goofy over weird any day. Alright, so this is the rest not quit. Beautiful illustration. I love this. This Arthur, so Andrea Furtick is her name. And Furtick is a very um, special last name because Stephen Furtick, his last name is Furtick as well. Anyway, so rest not quit. So exhaustion creeps in like the night on even the most valiant of warriors. For how one's aim, for how can one's aim be precise? I'm sorry. Be precise when one's eyes are heavy. Perhaps one shall close them for a bit, having worked hard and fought tirelessly, even when alone, this moment of pause is well deserved. So allow the light of the moon to recharge you like the power of the almighty amethyst. Sharpen your mind with slumber and stiffen your stride with a moment of stillness. For your strength shall be restored and path brightly lit in the morning, but for now rest and be recharged. No harm shall come to you at this moment, for the ancestors stand guard. At this moment, dear, you need rest. Thank you. I love to sleep. So you have been a mighty force of reckoning on the path of your desires, but accomplishments are harder to come by with exhaustion in the shadows. I agree. So one will not be as sharp or as swift as if fully rested. So for now, lay down your wand and sword and have a rest. So trust the universe to protect you as you close your eyes and rest assured that you and your camp are safe. When you awaken, you will be at optimal precision and ready to fight on once again. Nice. Am I, am I getting chapped? My chaps are so far. Okay, I'm almost done. It's very cold out here, so it's making my lips chap. All right, so the one of wonders is the very last card. I am tripping on this cootie cat. Anyway, <laughs> so unexpectedly within a deserted place, a vision of magnificence appears like magic. So treasure treasures she holds. I don't know why that was so hard but only for the right one and for all others she holds a maze of mystery and traps so are you the one be sure before you enter enter into her world because it is just that hers however 
Should you be the right one, there could be a destiny of abundance and joy beyond her test. So are you the one to uncover the one of wonders? So they have a platonic in regards to another, platonic in regards to romantic relationship and in regards to self. I don't have a platonic or a romantic relationship. Matter of fact, I'm going to read platonic and in regards to self because we were talking about friendships earlier, so that would be considered platonic. So this person has something that you desire. However, you will have to prove yourself of your worthiness prior to the transfer of possession. If you truly want it, pay attention and go to this. That ain't got shit to do with me because I don't know what the hell you're talking about. Anyway, in regards to self, <laughs> um... You are about to meet a new version of yourself without warning. Okay, that's much better. So embrace it. I will. At this time, transformation is here and you are the one of wonders. Ah, I'm the one of wonders, baby. And I'm so beautiful. It's about to go. Go. Hey, it's about to go. I'm about to learn how to play poker too, so I can start going to the casinos and sitting at the table and playing poker with the guys. But that was lit. I'm very excited about that. That came because in my mind, I'm thinking about New Year's Eve. Your girl going to DC. Um, so I'm really excited about that. Christmas on the way supposed to be going to my co-worker house for New Year's Eve, but I highly doubt I'm doing that shit because I don't even like this motherfucker. The only reason why she invited me over there is because her friend invited me to her house for Thanksgiving, so now she like, oh, I want Shay at my house too because I was such a heck. <laughs> According to her, which I think is very strange to say that somebody is a hit <laughs> at Thanksgiving. cleanse our energy get all that out the air i hope everyone received this message positively this was a very good message i'm can't wait to post this the sun is trying to leave me it's getting cold so we trying to lean up into the sun but anyway thank you for watching it's been a wonderful day here at the lake i feel really good about my life now i was definitely pissed off earlier because my check ain't come but it sounds like it's on the way and it sounds like it's gonna be on time. It sounds like my finances are no longer about to be a burden of mine. I definitely have more. I've been begging the universe to like, please help me manage my money better. So hopefully that's in my cards, which it sounds like it. Um, shout out to everybody who I have um, platonic relationships with. I'm not even gonna call them friendships right now. Platonic relationships. Um, I love everybody and I hope nobody was offended by anything I said in either or video. I definitely meant what I said. Um, but I do love you. I have a lot of love for you and I have a lot of love for everybody. I'm always here to be a listening ear. But like I said, I'm listening with the intent of giving you solutions and guiding you through um, making this a better situation for you. However, I'm not here for pity parties. I don't throw pity parties, okay? We can vent, find a solution, fix it, and celebrate, but we're not gonna just complain and pity party, okay? I love you. Thank you for watching. Stay tuned for more.